This is a durian husk. It makes up about 60% of the weight of a durian and it's also the part that we usually throw away without a second thought. But researchers in Singapore have discovered a way to make this husk useful by turning it into a hydrogel bandage which would not only be cost effective but also eco-friendly. The technology behind the durian bandage was developed by a team of researchers from Nanyang Technological University and is led by Professor William Chen. The process involves extracting cellulose from the husks and combining it with glycerol to create a soft gel which can be cut into bandages. They also add some compounds from baker's yeast to make the gel antibacterial. So why durian? Because in Singapore, very much like in Malaysia, we love eating durian. Along the way, we generate a lot of durian husk. So there is a potential to apply simple technology to extract cellulose and convert them into hydrogel to solve the problem of reducing solid food waste. Uh, these bandages, would they have a durian smell? The fragrance comes from the fruit, the flesh, not from the seed, not from the husk. Therefore, it's odorless. There's no smell. The product is similar to conventional hydrogel patches in the market which are used to hydrate wounds and reduce scarring. But because these bandages are composed of fully organic material, Professor Chen says they do not contain metallic components such as silver ions or materials like acrylic which can be found in synthetic bandages. Can this technology be applied on other fruits or plants? So as long as we have a plant around us, we will be able to sustainably produce hydrogel based bandages which are sustainable, biodegradable and consumer friendly because they are organic. Professor Chen says the product could hit the market in about two years and with a competitive price. With about 2-3 kg of durian husk, we can produce 1,600 bandages of this size. What's the message you would like to impart to the viewers watching this video? Food waste is actually not a waste. It's actually a misplaced resource. I, I will not say you need extremely brainy people. No, you just need to look around. Integrate what you have learned. Integrate what you have seen and try to apply to develop a simple solution to solve problems. I think this is all about how we can contribute to the full waste reduction.